guys, I'm Donna Latavi and I want to tell you guys about my experience with Dr. Mario and why I think he is a little bit of a scammer, not 100% of a scammer, but he got a little scamming in him. So basically, once upon a time, not long ago, I was really insecure about my teeth, so I was looking for a dentist and I found him and I was like, oh my god, let me like contact him and I did and then... Um, I told him when I was gonna fly in he was like, okay, that's cool So I flew into Colombia and he told me for 20 bucks that um, He was gonna send his driver to the airport to pick me up to take me to a hotel that is conveniently near his dentist I was like dentist office, right? I was like, okay, cool. So basically I get to Colombia um, He told me it was gonna be the whole dental procedure was gonna be 5,500. I was like, okay, so I arrived to Colombia and then um, his driver comes and picks me up. I give him 20 bucks and he drops me off at a hotel. It turns out that hotel that Dr. Mario recommended is actually his hotel. He charges $100 a night. And actually, 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 um, if you walk like a block more down or like two blocks down, um, you'll find like way better hotels for like 40 bucks, you know? um and he'll literally be like he'll hype up the room and be like oh yeah it's a it's a great room it has a hot tub and this and that but actually like i'm not bashing at all i'm saying like the truth um literally like the water pressure was really bad really really bad um so oh yeah and, and like he tells you when you're gonna come to colombia that the whole procedure takes about five hours so you only need to book for like 12 hours maximum or a day if you really want to but you're only going to be needed like to be there with him for about five hours right so i ended up booking my flight for an hour for a day and a half right um which means i had to pay the hotel for two days understandable right um so yeah once uh he told me like okay you, you arrive yes 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 i confirmed to him i arrived and then he tells me, like, okay, come to this dentist's office at 2 p.m. I was like, okay, cool. So I arrive there at 2 p.m. And then he's, like, working um, on some other person. He's like, oh, hey, I'm running 45 minutes late. I'm like, okay, cool. And then after 45 minutes, he's like, oh, yeah, actually, um, can you come back, like, in 90 minutes? I was like, you know what? Like, yeah, okay. So I ended up just walking around Colombia, like, like, like <laughs> I was just walking around Colombia for like 90 more minutes and then once I was done once the 90 minutes was done um I go ahead and head back to the dental office and he told and he tells me uh, okay I'm thank you for waiting I'm ready to like get started on you on your one million dollar smile like he like made me feel cool for waiting like literally almost two hours Anyways, um, then once I sit down, he puts, like, a little bib on me. He starts talking about, about my teeth. Um, like, he stops and he's like, whoa, uh, when a, someone that I just worked on needs me to do, like, a little touch-up on their teeth. Do you mind if I help them really quick? I was like, no, because I already freaking waited, like, two hours, you know? And the procedure takes five hours, so that's, like, seven hours of me just there, like, right? So, yeah, so I told him, um, like, so basically, um, I told him, no, I'm sorry, I'm not gonna, like, no, and yeah, that was kind of mean of me, but really, really, nigga, really, um, so then he's, like, he tells the other person to go away, and he's gonna help me, and, and come back, so then, like, I go, um, right, so he's, like, working on my mouth, and then he, he, like, he started sucking up all like the wetness in my mouth and he was telling me that uh, I have like two cavities and I was like oh, okay well can you like fix them you know before you cover them with something can you fix them he was like yeah sure so he like covered um he like fixed my this is like where the scamming part comes like he said he fixed my cavities he didn't really fix my cavities okay he just I don't know what he did, but he asked me for, I think it was like $80 per cavity. So yeah, I gave him 80 and then another 80 to fix two cavities. And then he's like, okay, cool. And then your cavities are all covered. And now I'm going to go ahead and put this, um, 
paste like I don't know I forgot exactly what he uses but like he doesn't use like the highest quality paste to make your teeth he doesn't he uses basically like cavity fillers to fill up your whole teeth and mold them into like teeth and stuff um it's really cheap it's not like anything strong it's not anything like that and this is all that i'm like that my dentist now my new dentist in america is telling me like they're like no what he's using is like bs like this is not actual actual like this is not even a procedure like this is something that he made up in his monkey head and he's like doing it on everybody so okay right so i paid him 80 bucks and then the other 80 so he fixed up my teeth and he starts like molding my teeth my new teeth onto my mouth right and then i tell him um right so then i finish up and then i go home back to washington dc right and then um literally like two months later one of my teeth is having so much pain like oh my god it's hurting so freaking much and then um i'm just like wiggling it a little bit because like whenever i wiggled it like it would hurt less and then like my whole tooth like fell out and then when i saw like the inside it was like brown it was decayed and then i'm thinking that's a teeth that had a cavity and instead of him like actually curing the cavity he just put something on top of it like that's what he means like no shaving no this no 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 shaving the teeth yeah he's not shaving the tooth like he's just putting something on top like a thin layer of cavity filler like on top you know so he just covered up my cavity so it wasn't having like direct contact with um cold and hot stuff that's why i didn't feel it right away but it was decaying in the inside right and then remember the other cavity that i had right that i told you guys so that one did the same thing like both my teeth fell out like i was having two missing teeth so then i went to my doctor in the u.s and i was like hey doctor in the u.s um can you like help me can you can you advise me like what to do and he basically told me look everything that dr mario put in your mouth is complete bs he didn't cover no cavities your cavities were there and they decayed rot in your tooth and that caused your teeth to fall out right um mind you that was like a small those were like small cavities they were not like root canals or big big things like that right so um so I told him, okay, well, I want to get implants. Like, my teeth are gone. Can you, like, pull them out and then, like, you know, give me implants? And he was like, no. Because that, like, paste thing that Dr. Mario uses for, like, to cover your teeth up and then mold them to, like, new shapes and stuff and more straight. Um, if I put a cavity on there, it's going to just pop off that, that, like, cap that he put on your tooth. And I was like, oh, my God. He's like, yeah. So I ended up having to redo my whole mouth here in the U.S. And what I'm going to say about Dr. Mario is, Dr. Mario, you literally, I don't even know what to say. Um, if you guys don't believe me about Dr. Mario, I'm going to show you guys a picture of us. This is me a long time ago, and that's Dr. Mario. Um, I mean, honestly, like, the smile that he gave me was kind of, like, boxy looking. And then these are a whole new smile that cost 30000 here in the U.S. And this is, like, the real deal. You know, these are all implants. They're not veneers. They're not little, like, thing like that. No, like, they're all, they're all, like, perfect. Mm, you guys can see. Mm. Hey, free stop it. Wait. So basically, I just want to say, I was going through Dr. Mario's um, Instagram, and I saw a lot of teeth like this, that were just brown, like, here and there. And I want to say that, look, obviously, your teeth are not supposed to be brown. They're supposed to be, like, white or a little yellowish, but when they're brown, like, brown means cavity brown means decayed like there's no way someone can come in an office with a teeth on the right and then walk out with a teeth like that there's no freaking way like no dentist can make magic work like that in five hours no because this right here it took like 
at least I would say like a whole month and a half and it took a lot of dentist appointments and it took a lot of money and there's no freaking way like even if like honestly in situations like this now since I have so much like dental experience all I can say is yeah his teeth are gonna decay underneath that coat paste that he put in there um and he's going to and those are not veneers like he calls them veneers they're not veneers um and any type of like redness around it's basically around the gums it's called inflation your gums are inflamed eventually what's gonna happen is your gum is gonna be like red right red 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 and then after a while you're gonna feel pain up here and that basically means that um like ugh, fuck i forgot exactly what it's called but basically you're gonna get it's like eating up the inside tooth up here and then you're gonna have a little pimple here and it's gonna hurt and yeah like shit gets bad and i feel like he is definitely scamming for example this is literally kind of like what happened to me. You see the tooth in the top? Well, mine was never that bad. You see how it's brown and it has a hole? So basically, he should cover that up, fix it up, and then put the paste on top. But I don't think he's doing that at all. Um, yeah, guys. So basically, that's just this is my video, and I'm just going to bring awareness. Um, if your teeth are bad, bad... 5,500 is not fixing it. If you're a broke ass, like this broke ass, like I know he's a famous rapper, but literally, like, what well, famous rapper wouldn't be like, oh yeah, 5,500, let me take some, let me like take, like, let me take advantage, you know? No, if you got money, do it the right way. And for a good example, is 6ix9ine. Like, 6ix9ine got his smile done by him, and 6ix9ine ended up getting a whole new smile later. Look at this. Ask yourself. Be realistic. Does a smile like this going to become that at the bottom in five hours? No. No. It's a scam. If it's too good to be true, it's too good to be true. For real, guys. Anyways, this is my video. My truth. Allegedly. Um, I hope you guys like my video. And yes, I am dressed as Velma. <laughs> I'm just as Velma. Well